Good morning, everybody. Well, um, I would have loved to get this out last night, but I had to do it this morning because it took a while to get the uh, the camcorder version of this out. Uh, this is the night vision version. Um, it came out better than I thought it would because usually there's too much light flooding the camera. Um, what you see right now is an airplane coming into land up high and three UFOs under it. And it's very obvious that these are UFOs. Uh, they're popping in and popping out. Um, what looks like three turns into four and then to five. You know, it's really hard to explain everything that's going on, but basically when you see the great big lights that are coming from left to right, usually those are airplanes coming in to land. Um, you will also see a lot of helicopters flying left and right. I believe that these UFOs that you're looking at in the middle of the screen right now are about 29 miles from my home. At a minimum, they would be 27, so between 27 and 29 miles. Um, the airplanes that are coming in to land are very close to the Las Vegas Strip. And depending on what part of the Strip that we're talking about, it can be 12 or 13 miles away from my home. So it's pretty much right in the middle of where I see these things. You know, I mean, obviously here comes another airplane. And right now, down low, in the middle, there's four different lights. Uh, maybe even five at this point, because the one that's the highest looks like three little lights. But you can definitely tell the difference. Uh, here comes a helicopter, and look how it's flashing. Uh, these objects don't do that. So anyway, they're all down low. This is the night vision uh, portion of the same video I put out last night. Um, they get a lot of questions on what these are. Um, one today asked if they are TR3Bs. Well, you know, to be honest, I can't answer you uh, what these are other than being incredible uh, phenomena. Um, you know, until I can see one up close, or see the pilot, or see anything like that, the only thing I can tell you is that I'm really lucky to have caught it, and that it is amazing technology. I don't know if it's extraterrestrial or man-made. Uh, the one thing I do know is that it is amazing, and that has been my whole point since day one. You know, people can argue you know, whether or not these are aliens, pleadians, reptilians, tall whites, grays, the list goes on and on. Uh, they can argue about that. I'm not going to get caught up in that. Uh, what I want to show is that whatever this is, it's very real and it's going on all over the world. Um, I'm very fortunate to live in Las Vegas and live up high where I can see hundreds of square miles of the city and the surrounding mountains. Uh, because of that, um, I have a real advantage in terms of being able to go out and film these things. Um, it's, a, it's a numbers game, you know. Uh, next month will make three years in a row that I've been doing this at every opportunity. You know, and that helps explain why I have so much video. I put in thousands and thousands of hours outside, and I'm constantly watching. Um, I've learned to identify these areas, and be, I'm able to tell the difference between what a UFO light looks like and what an airplane or helicopter light looks like. You know, over the last three years, I've even seen a lot of uh, drones, you know, consumer drones flying around, but they're so easy to tell. And even when they're a mile or two away, they become so tiny that they do not show up like this. So what we're looking at now, there's an airplane coming in and two UFOs right under it. But anyway, I'm going to quit blabbing. I'm going to finish this out with music. Um, 
The night vision camera is not capable of recording audio, or I would be speaking on that as well. But anyway, enjoy this. This is the night vision version. Once again, the big lights, like the one on the right, are passenger planes. The ones like you see pretty much in the middle right now are UFOs. Anything going right to left that's flashing is usually a helicopter. So anyway, enjoy you guys. This was a, uh, a really uh, special night, and it actually began with a, a, a nice pretty sunset. So anyway, um, enjoy this video. I haven't made any alterations at all to it. This is exactly how it came off the camera.